Now that you've created and exported your video, it is time to upload your video to YouTube. All you need to do is create a free account with YouTube and click on the upload button. After that, you'll just need to select where your .mov file is located on your local computer and it will be uploaded. What I would like to emphasize more on in this video is how to search engine optimize your video. To illustrate this better, let me show you an example of a video that appears in the search engine results. Let's search for the keyword best post pregnancy exercise. As you can see, YouTube videos appear on the first page results. Now, Let's go through a checklist on how to search engine optimize your video. Firstly, you will need to insert your keyword in the video title. In this example, the video has been optimized to the keyword best post pregnancy exercise. You can also insert related keywords into your title so that you can possibly rank for more than one keyword. For example, this video has inserted Tai Chi weight loss post-pregnancy workout as the related keyword. If I head back to Google and search for the keyword weight loss pregnancy workout, you can see the video appears for this keyword for the front of for the front page of Google too. Another thing to note about your titles is be sure to use different titles when submitting to different video directories. You see, search engines cannot read the content of your video. The only way they will be able to know what your video is about is through your title and description. With that said, when you vary your titles for different video directories, you can rank even more keywords on the search engine for the same video. Next, insert your website URL at the beginning of the video description. This way, everyone can click on it without having to expand the description panel by clicking on the, on the down arrow. For better click-through rates, you should include your website URL at the very beginning and end of your video description. For your text description, make sure your keyword is inserted in the first sentence of your description. Also, when you're trying to rank for multiple keywords, make sure your related keywords are sprinkled within the description text as well. For your tags, this is where you should insert the keyword phrase that you are trying to rank for and also copy the tags of the most viewed videos in your niche as discussed in the earlier videos. It is important to organize your tags properly so that you can get more exposure by getting an edge in ranking within YouTube or the video directory itself. Be as descriptive as possible with your tags. By putting in the correct tags, it will allow your videos to appear when viewers look at similar videos. YouTube will display your videos on the video suggestion section and you can see that right here. These are all the related videos and from this example most of them are all about pregnancy weight loss and post-pregnancy workout. So as you can see for this video the tags are post-pregnancy exercise, post-pregnancy workout, post-pregnancy belly, post-pregnancy, Tai Chi weight loss, Tai Chi, and post-pregnancy Tai Chi. The final thing to optimize for your video is your account username. Your username should be the main keyword you are trying to rank for or a related keyword. In this example, the account username is post-pregnancy belly. Once you've uploaded and optimized your video, We'll move on to the next video where you'll learn how to use videos to promote your product and services to skyrocket your sales. Until then, I'll see you in the next video.